Hey guys, I thought I'd do another aquaponics update today. Uh, this is grow bed number three, and right now it's got some ryegrass and a little cilantro, and then a kale that seems to be growing very well outside of that uh, that root guard pump. There's no media in that, so it's just living off of the water. Uh, there's some asparagus, and I'll be doing some companion planting with some basil and some other other plants in there that are companions. Uh, the RFF filter is doing well. Uh, I put in some catfish habitats here. I'll be getting, I'm sorry, crawdads. I, I'll be getting some crawdads this Friday, and I'm hoping that they'll hang out here. I'm not sure where they'll do okay, but I'm going to try different locations over here. I'm going to put a net over this so that they can't escape. And then I'm also going to throw some in the tank and maybe some in that minnow cage. This is a bean plant for, uh, from seeds from last year that, that it looks like it's starting to perk up finally. Here's my uh, mushroom experiment. And basically I've got some inoculated, um, it's probably hard to see, but I've got some inoculated um, wood chips that should, with some dowels in there, that should uh, produce some lobster flavored mushrooms. As it turns out, this thing provides a perfect environment for the mushrooms because the, the flood and drain uh, keeps the, um, the mushrooms at the perfect temperature. You can see how humid it is in there, and which is exactly what the mushrooms want. Here's a grow bed that's uh, not in the light with the plants not doing so great. Lots of black soldier flies everywhere. Uh, they're also collected down here in the bin. Uh, hopefully you can see them. But yeah, there they are in the bin. Um, I do throw them into the fish tank and also throw some inside of that auto fish feeder. Uh, fish tank is real busy. There's the, the minnow trap that I'm gonna use for storing some crayfish and perhaps some baby minnows. There's a catfish home that I built that hopefully the catfish will live in. Uh, here's another uh, black soldier fly hanging out. They're pretty much everywhere. I'm hoping they'll breed. And here's the, the three sisters garden. I've got the corn, beans and squash. I've got another kale plant that I stuck inside this contain in this root guard that's also doing well. Uh, overall everything seems to doing, be doing pretty well this season. Uh, my nutrient levels are probably a little bit better. Uh, the next video I'm going to do is going to, uh, after this one, I'm going to throw the uh, camera into the, into the pond so you guys can see the pond activity. Thanks a lot and I appreciate you guys watching.